All right, let's get started. Happy Thursday, everyone. How are we doing today? Happy, happy Thursday. What's up, Gongus? What's up, Dre? Good to see you guys. How are we doing? Who's ready to take on Team Rocket and stuff? Team Rocket and stuff, you know? Hello, streamer. Hello, Tatsuya Act. Thank you for the, the follows, Ulv and Lilf's head. Remember, it's free to follow. You should follow me. You'll get notified when we continue this journey or whatever. Mm. Pretty good other than being sick and I'm immense pain. Oh, well, I'm sorry mm. to hear that. Apologies, apologies. Well, I'm feeling good. I'm not that sick. Looking good. Bonjour. Bonjour to you, Alia Salguin. Uh, for those of you who don't know, we're doing Soul Silver, which is a Drayano ROM hack. No, this is not the update. The update will be called something different. So, no, there's not fairy types either. But we're doing this now because Dre Dude, has so utmost confidence go. that I'll be Dre able to beat it boss. before he finishes it. So if that doesn't happen, it's entirely Dre's fault. He either overestimated me or underestimated himself, and I don't know which one's worse. So, how's your Thursday going? It's going well. Poison is the best type. Good to see ya. And Ayanto E. Dragok, thank you for the seven months. Really appreciate it. Dre will only finish this in like mid-2024. Are you ready for Bugsy? I am not, because we have something before Bugsy. We have Slowpoke Well, as in this. You're getting better at the name? I couldn't couldn't tell you what I'm doing different. I'm going to be entirely... Ooh, who's that guy? Wait, who's this shifty man back here? Ah, oh, you found me. I used to be a thief, but then I... But kid thievery isn't always bad. Oh, he gave me the TM46 thief. Look at that. Nice. Nice. I was midway through the VOD right about now. Well, hell yeah. Ba 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 bum 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 bum. Hang on, Slowpoke Old Kurt is on the way. Which starter did you pick? I didn't even realize you'd started this game until today. I picked Chikorita. I, uh, purely on my own decision. The VOD and now you're online. How lucky. Hey, thanks for being here, A.O. Galvo. Thank you for these six months via fi uh, Prime. Sorry, I got ahead of myself. I said Fime because I was going to say, Folks, did you know that if you have Amazon Prime, you can subscribe for free by linking your Prime account to your Twitch account? For free? It takes money from Amazon and gives it to me, little old me. <coughs> Yo, Ianto E. Dragok, thank you for the five gifted community subs. Holy cow. Why did you do that? What are you doing? Oh my goodness, that's very generous. Nice to see an honest criminal encourage the youth in following his footsteps. Aren't they the best? So guys, we got to figure out what our um, slowpoke well encounter is. Looks like I can guarantee... Hey, Stormwolf with the sub. We got the hype train, hype train, hype train, hype train, hype train. Ooh, 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 ooh. Maybe a slow poke. That would be pretty good, huh? So we can guarantee, though, at 16, we can guarantee either Shelter, Swine Up, Ghastly, or Bronzong, which is pretty banger. But then again, so is everything in here. Uh, slow poke, Ghastly, Shellow, Shelter, Swine Up, Snow Run, Bronzor. Honestly, Snow Run's probably the worst. If I old rod, I have a 60% magic carp or a 30% slowpoke or a 10% barbo. Like the new layout with the balls on the side. Dollar DHF today. Hey, thanks, there of mine. This is not particularly new though, but I appreciate it. Thank you for the four months. Um, it's just different based on which game I'm playing because, like, sizing and space and shit, you got to be optimized, you know. Another prime though, pretty sick. Thank you for all the follows, Mandy and Quee 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 Yana, maybe and Ray's Moos. Whiskash is mega buffed in this. Mobile, I don't know. 
I don't know, Chief. I don't know. Um, so the question is, do I have enough water types, first off? I have two water types, but one of them's trash. Let's go look at the box again. <sighs> Hi, this is my first flag on stream. Well, thanks for being here, gamer. Uh, gamer gal J. How you doing? Oh, uh, what's the J stand for? So we got tentacool and core fish as our two water types, which are pretty trash right now. Honestly, getting Gyarados would be pretty toit. Gyarados or Slowpoke? I mean, it'd be cool to have Bronzor. That's a si ice, uh, pfft, that's a steel type. Ghastly, also a ghost type. Pretty, pretty banger. Or Shelter and Swinub would also be really good. We already do have a ground type though, right? Don't we have two ground types? We do. No ice types, but... I suppose we can take Gyarados. Let's go, let's go surf. Although, no, yeah, it's fine. We can go fish. Let's go for a fishing trip. You can get Gara elsewhere, right? Where though? Not in Ilex Forest. Oh, never mind. In Ilex Forest, you can get Gara or Poliwag. That's pretty good. Especially because Ilex Forest encounters kind of dog. You can guarantee Kadabra from Route 34. Shroomish, Ladybob, Pineco, Execute, Baneri, Badoo, Pikachu, Butterfree, Beedrill, Roselia. I'm not really loving that. And what's uh what's Poliwag versus Carp? Uh what is did Poliwag get any changes, any buffs? Did uh Poly Toad get the thingy majiggy? Poliwhirl, Poly Wrath. Like, does Polly Whirl, uh, Polly Toad, does he have the Drizzile? He does! He does! They're both insanely good. So maybe I should wait, because I have some pretty good answers into into, uh, what's his name? Into Bugsy, I think. Maybe, maybe not. You can get Magikarp and Ruin of Alf. Yeah, I haven't been there, but then you don't get Girafige. No Natu, no Smeargle, no Girafige. Ooh, you could Rock Smash for Nose Pass. That's pretty tight. Yeah, I could also guarantee Dratini if I catch Magikarp and uh, Remoraid. I really don't want to accidentally get Rem Remoraid, though, you know? Because that would be uh, a bummer. It is a 60% chance to get Magikarp, though. But Poliwag also 40%. Pretty good. Octillery Goaded? Nah, you're lying. You're lying. Guys, thank you for the hype train. That's pretty cool. Octillery, Octillery, Octillery. Octillery is not goaded. Octillery got no buffs. Need answers for the Scyther? Uh, I have Geodude, right? Yeah, U-Turn only does what? 35 to 43%. It's fine. <laughs> Shit. Uh, I guess I forgot that Geodude does not resist U-Turn. Might want to delay Gera until Lake of Rage. Hmm. Do I... That's pretty far away. That would be post-Morty. And at that point, I don't know how useful Gyarados is, to be honest. Hey, Dre, have you changed the headbutt Pokemon at all? Oh, but if you get Gyarados, you can guarantee Feebas from Lake of Rage. 
That's pretty cool. They're unchanged in this. Hmm. Didn't know how to do it at the time. Brutal honesty. Brutal honesty. Love it. So, okay. Um. Yeah, damn, that Scyther, pretty scary, pretty scary. Can we outspeed it with anything? Can we outspeed it with the old razzle-dazzle of Furret? Nope. Oh, we speed tie. Wonderful. Speed tie at 22. Oh my god, the Scyther is cracked. Unbelievably cracked. What do I do against this Scyther? Uh-oh, we're in trouble. All right, maybe we do get the uh, the old Gyarados. We get Gary Dose. Yeah, because Geodude's our only our only wing attack answer. What happens if we freaking miss Rock Throw? We lose. I guess we have citrus berries now. We just gotta dodge one crit, that's all. Psh, psh, shit, you know? Yeah. It's probably fine. Okay, so what was I doing? Do we wanna go to a uh, freaking do we want to go to freaking place? Or do we want to old rod and slow poke well for the old Gary Potter? None of these other Pokemon help me against Bugsy other than Magikarp. Self-destruct on Scyther. Hey, don't knock it. Oh, wait. All right, you know what? Let's go Ruins of Alf. Why the F not? Let's go get that Ruins of Alf encounter. When can you even evolve Dragonite anyways? I don't know. Looks like the Elite Four. <laughs> we can get Dratini somewhere else, I'm sure. Oh wait, we have Gligar. Gligar, how does Gligar deal with sight there? Gligar! He will have to be level 20 so he doesn't over uh disobey. Ah, wing attack, we we take those. How much does Aerial Ace do? Ah, it's a two shot without Citrus Berry, which it does have, okay. Gyarados means guaranteed Dratini in Dragon's Den. Well, there you go. Isn't there always guaranteed Dratini with the gift? QED. Dude, we don't have time for this. We don't have time for this. Fur it. Buddy. Uh-oh, we only have three repels. All right, we got we to gotta bargain these. Wow, I didn't actually put the repel on, did I? All right. Let's go get... Oh shit, I'm low on money. I have no money. It's okay, I guess theoretically you can just farm for shards, right? So there's unlimited money. All right, let's get that magic carp, baby. Wait, do I have Pokeballs? I just need one, obviously. <laughs> ah, I got a Lure Balls. Okay, we Gucci, here you go. 
da 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 Nice! Level 11 magic carp. Easy! What everybody needs to start thinking about what type of instrument magic carp is. As I catch it with a single ball. Nyeh! <laughs> What? What are you doing to me, Magic Carp? You still have Leech Life? Oh, you got Hypnosis. Okay, hold on. Oh my God, it knows Reversal. I'm sorry. Why does Dre? Dre, why does this have Reversal? Easy. Hey, if it's fast enough, we can just destroy uh, the the normal type gym leader, huh? All right, one ball HG, we got it. Magic harp. That's kind of funny. But I do think that saxophone, Gyarados just looks like a saxophone or a bassoon. We can do bassoon. Did we do bassoon already? Bassoon. Rain stick gang. <laughs> I think bassoon is good. Okay, this also means that we can repel Manip for the uh for the uh the guy. He's him. This is huge. God, we should have done this Name last time. Anderson, PLS. 12? Oh, wait, wait, wait. At nighttime, I can guarantee Magnemity because I already have Drifloon. Yo. LFG, baby. LFG. Oh, once we got Magnemity, Scyther's DOA. All we have to do is just wait for the night to change. They're only getting drunk, maybe. Does it ever drive you crazy? Just how fast the night changes. No, 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 no. Docile. Okay, I'll take it. I'll take docile. Wait, Dre, what the hell were you cooking over here? Bubble, reversal, and tackle? You sick son of a bitch. <laughs> what are you doing? It doesn't even know Splash! What's going on? Swift Swim Reversal. Yeah, that's, that's wild. Dre is an... Dre is freaking Carmi. Freaking Carmi from the bear. It's probably an old event. <laughs> Carp is just unusable without Splash. Yeah, hell yeah. Um, all right. Well, let's go get the guaranteed magnemity. There's a lots of weird stuff in this one. I'm, I'm picking up on that, but I like it. Go, Magikarp! Go, Magikarp! Go! Life is pain, Magikarp. All right, so I need to go find a Magnemity, but I must first, but first, but first, um, do you have Grass Whistle? Yeah, you do. You do, Chifo. All right. All right. Um, all right, we Gucci, we Gucci, we Gucci, we Gucci. House of Gucci. House of Gucci. House of Gucci. Um. Why Torchic over Damp Mudkip? I don't know. Why not? Um. 
You've probably been asked this to death, but I gotta ask, will you or have you attempted Emerald Kaizo? I am a huge fan, but I don't really watch Twitch, so I only catch up with your YouTube videos. Um, I've never fully played through Emerald Kaizo because it's been done to death and it's not super, super interesting to me, to be entirely honest, to just, like, do something that somebody's already, like, 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 just follow the, like, the roadmap. But, um, I'm sure I'll do it at some point. I've done some Emerald Kaizo content, which is on the channel. Let's go. Let's go, buddy. Don't you want to follow Alb's 200-page EK guide? Yeah, as fun as that sounds, I'm going to say no. I don't. All right. All right, show me magnanimity. Come on, Magic Carb, do your damn job. <laughs> easy, this game is fucking so easy. God, god damn. God damn! God damn, god damn, god damn. Um, Magnemite, Magnemity, what's your move set, Chief? Chiefy McChieferson? Okay, it's just regular Gen 4. Diamond and Pearl. Magnemity. At 12, what I really want to know is, do you have Thundershock? You do, but you do not have Sonic Boom. So you cannot deal damage to Accordion here. Ah, uh, you can use Tackle, I guess. I got Queen Basalt in this route. Shedinja is ban-worthy in this game. Yeah. I don't I don't use Shedinja most of the time. Nice, nice. Way to miss. Get all your misses out now, Magnemity. When is Shedinja not ban worthy? Uh, when you're playing something like, 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 how to beat Pokemon without taking damage or something. Or just, yeah, on a casual playthrough where nothing matters. Wow, we ain't gonna get Spark. We're gonna have to go in with Thundershock. Wow, he called the prediction. Big brain play. Does he get the para? He does not. He does not. Nice! We hit that 55% accurate wet grass we slay every time. Grass we slay, baby! All right. One ball. HG. HJ. One ball HG. Back at it again. If you don't have time to caramelize, pulverize. Hi, I'm Dr. Flygon HG from Disney Channel UK. What are we naming this? What type of instrument is this? What is a theremin? Sounds like that thing that that creepy lady did this theremin never seen this but it's an electronical music I'll, I'll do it am I saying it right theremin or is it their their men is it their men English language is so stupid is it the Riemann These are cool. Okay. I'm not going to get DMCA'd. All right. Um, easy peasy lemon squeezy. Bugsy, your body, is it ready? Yeah. 
and abracadoodle. It is daytime. All right. So now we could guarantee Slowpoke now that we have freaking what's his name? Oh, yeah, it's either Whiskash or Slowpoke. Honestly, yawn on Slowpoke. Yawn, big bulky yawner. I was a bit confused about your current party mons because the overlay shows different mons. Yeah, it's because I do it manually because I'm into that whole, whole deal, you know? So I'm only going to change it for important stuff. Otherwise, half the time would be changing stuff. I do need to set up uh, Try Pokey Link again. The one time I did it, I was thoroughly unimpressed by the capabilities of Pokey Link. I'm just saying. I was like, this is dog shit. Uh, excuse me. I'd like to get out of here. It was very glitchy. It didn't work. Pokelink is big. Big sus. Is that what that is? Sussy. Yeah, Pokelink. Do you use something or do you just not have a layout? I, I I don't know. What do you what do you Oh wait, let's go check out our friend Magnemity. You and RT gotta coordinate. It's very hard to simultaneously support my two favorite streamers. Who's RT? RT Gaming, that guy. He raided me once, so he seems like a nice fella. Uh, move, Pokemon. Um, I think I can confidently say that us collaborating is the balls in his court kind of thing. But, uh, ooh, Magnet Pole. Wait. Wait. That means we can guarantee more Steel types. <laughs> <laughs> Relax nature. Um, not a, not amazing, but fine. Magnemity's not that fast, anyways. What's with our minus speed natures? Look at this, minus speed. It's like everything's minus speed. Of our Pokemon, we've got one, two, three, four. All right, four. I guess there's not that many, but still. What the hell? Um, okay. Guys, what do I want my Slowpoke well encounter to be? Well, well, well. Do we want Slowpoke? Or should I guarantee... Oh, wait, wait, wait. I don't guarantee Slowpoke. Sorry. I guarantee Polly. Sorry, sorry. There's no guarantee we're Slowpoke at all. I was, I was way off base. My humblest apologies. It's not Slowpoke. Fishing now guarantees 30 per... Oh, no, no, no. It is Slowpoke. What the hell was I talking about? Oh, Poliwag is in the forest. Right, right, right. Never mind. So it's 30% Slowpoke, 10% Barboach. So effectively 75% Slowpoke, 25% Barboach. Or I could guarantee either Ghastly, Shelter, Swine Up, Bronzor. If I do 16, I could guarantee, probably really guarantee Bronzor with the Magnet Pull. But I don't know if I want Bronzor. Is Bronzor any good? Has anyone ever used Politoed? Is that sarcasm? Politoed's like the best Pokemon you could have <laughs> in most ROM hacks. Shelder's pretty mid. Remember, I'm not using Setup, so anything with Shell Smash is significantly not that good. Gasly is good. Gasly is good. Yo, what up, DeSanto? How you doing? How you doing, Chief? Hey, how's it going, Chief? <coughs> Bronzor gets Nightshade now. That's pretty tight. Bronzong can learn Fly, you mad lad. Um... I mean, using Slowpoke does not prelude me from also using Politoed, so that's that's a false equivalent. You're right, Shell Smash is not a Gen 4 move, so. <laughs> well, 
Let's count Intimidate as Setup and leave Carp as Carp. <laughs> Um, yeah, nothing changed with Bronzong, but they did get Nightshade, which is cool. What's the alternative? Bronzong is a good pivot. Pivot! That yeah, could be. It very well could be. Let's see. Psychic types in this game would be good for Breloom. Slowbro is a leap four material. Oh, damn. Anybody ever brought Slowbro to the Elite Four in anything? <laughs> yeah, Barboach didn't get much of a boost. Lunastricorn with the redemption of the hat. Here, let's give Raid. I keep saying Raid whenever I take this hat. Ridge! Go backwards. Ridge Shadow Legend. Tia's boring. Anything is Elite Four material. It doesn't even get shell armor. So true, bestie. Ooh, it doesn't. It doesn't get shell armor. Yikers Island. Um, you know what? I'm feeling confident. We got Gera. We got Magnemity. Let's just go with the random encounter. I think the cash is being very underestimated here. Trust the cash. I don't want Whis Cash. Whis Cash is lame. All right, let's get let's get a 16 encounter. The question is, do I want to tip the scales in my favor of Bronzor, or do I just go completely guess for either Shelter, Swineup, Ghastly, Bronzor? Comfy Sean, thank you for the Just two months. The most recent fod and first time catching the stream live in a while. Loving the content and the run so far. Thanks. Thanks, Chief. Um, all right. All right, let's let her rip, as it were. I mean, all of these Pokemon pretty good, right? Did Shelter get anything, any boosts? Let me just double check that. Um, where the hell is Shelter in here? Nothing! It got no boosts, but it did get Bubble Beam. Was that a Beyblade reference? You mean let it rip? That's just a saying. Um, all right. You get guaranteed cloister later. What? Honestly, Bronzong with Levitite might be pretty good. Why don't we do that? Why don't we why don't we get another Bronzong user? I'm aware that they say it in Beyblade. I'm cultured. Of course I've seen Beyblade. Hear me out. Four hour encounter routing stream. <laughs> Gongus, what do you think I should do? Just kidding. I don't care. I'm gonna be I'm gonna be my own person. Shut the shut shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Don't tell me what to do, Gongus. Ugh. 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 Uh I'm sure we can get Skarmory and shit. We don't want too many steel types. There's a chance at an ice type. Let's take it. Yeah? Let's take it. Let's 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 take the potential ice type encounter. Why not? Rarely does one find yourself in the frame of the thing, you know? Frame ver framely does the rare in the Well, actually Magnemite's kind of nice to have out here. Framely does the where in the who's and in inside, you know? Framely does the who's in the where inside. All right. Framely does the where in the who's. So, did you ever think that you could just do a thing until you couldn't? Torchic! 
what do you know, my little chiefo? Yeah, you don't get anything good. Okay. Yeah, you know what? You can have Peck. Why the fuck not? Here. Go nuts. Evolve, my sweet child, evolve. Ah! Ah! I spilled my water! So, the other day... Story time. Ah, oh, crap. Yeah. So the other day, I was going to the bathroom, and there was a little bit of water on the floor. And so parts of my pants got wet, and I was like, oh no, now the backs of my pants are wet. And it got me thinking that I don't think I've ever seen somebody with a bit of wetness on their pants. I've never once thought that grown adult pissed himself. So, like, what's up with that? Like, that's not a thing that most people think about, you know? Like, why? Great Zealous, thank you so much for the eight months. Via regular sub, a regular sub, you're just a regular fella. Thank you. Hey. All right, let's let Theranos get to level 16 or whatever. Um... I think I can confidently say tackle is a no-go. All right. We didn't start the fire. No, we didn't light it, but we tried to fight it. Okay. Okay. Some dude got explosive. Jesus Christ. Um, Belugulna. Thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. Um, wait, what are we doing? What are we doing? What's going on? Believe in the heart of the cards, Master Obi-Wan. Ooh, I should have gotten a quick ball while I was over there. Now I just look like a fool. Wait, are the quick balls here or elsewhere? I can't remember. Get out of my way, nerd. Uh, that doesn't help me. Well, we might as well get one of them. Oh, I don't have enough money. All right, well, fuck you too, I guess, chief. All right, let's do it, let's do it, let's do it, let's do it, let's do it. Did you watch Ahsoka? I did not. Um, I decided that I value my time. <laughs> Sorry, that was way too mean. Um, I've heard that Ahsoka's pretty good. Um, I've been burned too many times by IP television that is mediocre. Um, and so unless I hear that something is truly good... I'm not going to watch it. So I watched Andor, which was good. Honestly, this all boils down, and I'm sure anybody who's been around the block a few times with the Flag on HG channel, at least the Twitch channel, will know this. But it all boils down to Obi-Wan, which was just so bad. So bad. It actually, I think ruined Star Wars for me. I wasn't super hot on Star Wars in general to begin with, but Obi-Wan straight up ruined Star Wars for me. And now it is an uphill battle. Andor was incredible, but you know what? I didn't go, oh, maybe Star Wars has it figured out. After I watched Andor, I went, oh, Tony Scott, or not Tony Scott. What's his name? Tony Gilroy? Genius. So if Tony Gilroy makes a thing, I'll watch it. But I still think that Star Wars... <sighs> not going to be watching any Star Wars shows anytime soon. Watched a couple episodes of Mandalorian Season 3. Couldn't couldn't keep that up. Nah. Nah. We're not. We're not. No. 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 Sorry, Chiefs. Hot take? What's the hot take? Oh, your hot take is that Harry Potter is overrated? Eh, I don't know how about I don't know about that. Um I think Harry Potter has its own problems. Um it's a shame it was written by no one, but I think Harry Potter's pretty good. <laughs> Marvel fallen off too, hell yeah. But yeah, I also don't think that saying Harry Potter is bad is a hot take. 
Ted Lasso is a gem. Oh, wait, let me fix that. Ted Lasso season one is a gem. Season two is kind of watchable. Season three is a big mess. Big old mess. Big old mess. Harry Potter is children's media. It's not bad, but it's not for adults. I mean... I mean, it's all it's all right. It's all right. I, I think I think it's pretty good. I think I think I think the later books are pretty interesting and especially because it was written by no one. Um, I wouldn't encourage you to go buy a book, but this may be where piracy is morally morally okay. But yeah, the movies aren't particularly good. The library is free. There you go. There we go. There we go. Um, that's probably better than the whole thing that I said that was illegal. So, okay. Um, let's go <laughs> Let's go get that Pokemon. Not Dr. Flagon getting baited into a free five-minute movie review? Hey, I'm all for getting baited into being a little pissy wiener about Star Wars. Oh... Yeah, I mean, I'm sorry. Ahsoka just didn't look good from the trailers, and there's too much TV now to this point where I can just be like, oh, guess I'll try that, you know? Like, so, nope, nope, not my vibe. And, yeah. Yeah, I think I've become a little more intolerant of, like, TV that is mediocre to, like, passably okay. You know, like... I really, really don't care for TV that's like, that wasn't bad, you know? And I feel like most of the Disney Marvel stuff on the uh, the old DP has been perfectly described as that. Like, WandaVision's not bad. Didn't, but I don't know. I don't know. Everything else was. I might watch I might watch Loki season two because Loki season one was actually good. The Marvelous Mrs. Maisel is good. Yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> WandaVision lost all its flavor when they left the sitcom setting. Yup. Yup. When it became a uh, CBS spy show. Yeah, it stopped being good. Who'd have thunk? WandaVision was interesting until it remembered it was Marvel. Yeah, pretty much. All right, let's get our encounter. Last Guardians of the Galaxy was pretty good. I agree. The Last Guardians of the Galaxy was very good. Oh, Gasly. Okay, bet. Bet, bruh. Um, does this have Nightshade? Because that could be bad. Nite Shade. Does this have Nite Shade? Nite Shade? Oh, I agree. It was also really good stuff. <laughs> Did you just come in? What's up, bloody? 16. Level 16. It does have Nite Shade. Ooh. Yikes. Uh, that's okay. Surely he doesn't go down to a... Wait, what else does he have? Nite Shade? Oh, he's got Curse. All right, we got to be careful with that. Um, let's just put it to sleep with Grass Weasley and call it a day. Marvel is also called Copaganda anyways. I mean, yeah, but that's like all... Ooh, all ominous wind. Wait, what is Dre cooking? Oh my god. Oh my god, Dre! What are you doing to me, buddy? Oh my god! Oh god! Oh! <laughs> yeah, okay, it does have ominous wind. Wait, does it not have curse then? No, it should still have curse. Oh god! Uh, Alright, well, let's just wait for it to curse. Stick didgeridoo in there. Planned for 11 years for this moment. <laughs> Alright. Oh, shit. Wait, I should have waited. Now he's cursed. Didgeridoo, run! Wait, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. We're just going to get... We're going to one-ball HG right here. Ready? And... Spit on the ball.
Bro, never worried. I was never freaking worried. Gasolisle. All right, what does Gasolisle evolve into? Oh, I mean, sorry. Now what does it evolve into? What are we naming this? What type of musical instrument is this? Bloody, what musical instrument is Gasolisle? Beans. <laughs> Trombone? Why? How? 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 Slide whistle. <laughs> Chimes is pretty good. What's like an ancient... Okay, okay. Organ. Organ is good. I'm sorry, bloody. <laughs> but we're going with organ. Spooky. The spooky. Three spooky, five me. All right. Guys, it's Halloween season. Who's excited for Halloween? Can Bloody get dibs on the next name? Yeah, but of course she can. With the acknowledgement that this is not a democracy, this is a dictatorship, and nothing I promise is true. But yeah, sure, Bloody, go for it. <laughs> All right, um, bashful. He's bashful. Oh, he doesn't have night shide. Night, neat, neat shade. Good job, organ. Levitate, though. Pretty sick. Look at that special attack stat. That's cracked. Any Halloween themed videos planned? Oh, damn. Yeah, probably should have done that, huh? <laughs> Guys, I'm barely staying afloat, as is. Organ is speed. Bashful. Okay, so now it's time for the fight of our lives. Um, hey, hey, is anybody listening or watching this with their cat? Ready? Ready? This is for the cats out there. This is for the cats in the audience. Um... All right, all right, all right. All right, Team Rocket grunts, and then we got, oh my God, Executive Proton has a Voltorb. Eat my shorts, Executive Proton, with your Voltorb. Okay, so um, let's first kill everything else. I just thought, what is ghastly? Purple gas? Does it have organs? My head hurts. Well, take it easy there, chief. No need to no need to get all hot and bothered. Um alright, this team this squad looks pretty good. I maybe I don't fucking know. Let's furt the shit out of this, you know? If org in, what org out? <laughs> All right. I'm at work. Does this classify as productive use of my time? Depends. Humph! I was standing guard up top when some old coot yelled at me. He startled me so much that I fell down here. <laughs> oh... What a weenie move. What an absolute weenie move. Oh. Giga Chad Kurt. Yeah. <laughs> Pushing teenagers down wells. Rattata. All right. All right. All right. All right. Let's, uh, let's not accidentally activate guts. If we don't kill this in one shot. Easy. Didgeridoo for the didgery win. Oh. 
Now we can. Now it, let's freeze again. Nah, this kills. Didgeridoo's gonna didgeri get it. Chill out, Rattata. Flag on HG and freeze go hand in hand. Like, for cereal. For cereal. Oh, he's got Intimidati. This, this grunt is didgeri done. Well, not yet. He's got Intimidati. I think I'm going to go Boingo Boingo or whatever because I don't really want to be wrapped in here and stuff. Probably needlessly, needlessly safe. Oh, you know what? I probably, I probably, probably should, 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 should. God damn it. You know what? I don't, we don't have time for this. Okay. Um, run, run, didgeridoo. Freeze gone, HG. <laughs> wow. How creative. <laughs> I can be mean to bloody because we're friends. Um, what? That's what friendship is, right? So, okay. You think Grimer knows Mud Bomb or whatever? Ugh! Get out of here. My at got scared. If he thaws, he is freeze gone, HG. <laughs> See, that's good. That's a good one. Uh, that's freaking classic. Absolutely classic. All right. Rocket Grunt Grimare and Didgeridoo. I wanna I wanna burn this time. Okay, I'll take a crit. Hey! 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 Beebity babbity! Fine. I need to run this as a gen lock again soon. Ooh. What's a gen log? Oh, great. Zealous redeemed a five-minute movie review. Which movie doth want to review? Great Zealous. <laughs> You've activated my trap card, Poochiana. Idiot. Is it one game from every gen? How about your favorite horror slash Halloween themed movie for spooky season? What's my favorite? Like, I guess it depends on what you count as a horror movie and what you count as not a horror movie, you know? Full series better? What the hell are you doing? What? Um, like, Get Out's really good. That's one of my favorite horror movies, but I wouldn't say that's really Halloween-themed, you know? Like, what's Halloween-themed? You know what's a bad movie, but I like watching, is, um... Uh, Hocus Pocus. Also, Halloween Town. I like Halloween Town. Very charming. Those are fun. I didn't see the new Hocus Pocus, though. Sarah Jessica Parker from Halloween Town. Like, nice. As a kid, I was like, oh, nice. Um, oh, also, wait, what other Halloween movies are there? Halloween Town has the worst acting and costumes in Hollywood history. Uh, okay, sure. Nightmare Before Christmas. Is that a Halloween movie or is it a Christmas movie? I guess it's a Halloween movie. That's pretty good. I've only seen it the one time, though. I'm trying to think if there's, like, a movie that I watch every Halloween, and there really isn't. There really isn't. I've never seen Under Wraps. Uh, Cacnea and Nidorino. Or, like, Nidorino. Halloween trick or treat. No, never seen any of those. The Great Pumpkin Charlie Brown. I've. Corpse Bride. I haven't seen any, most of these. 
or like maybe I saw it like once a long time ago. Scream. Oh, Scream is really good. You need to watch Saw for Halloween. I'm I'm just like not that interested in like like what is that? Like gore porn? What is it called? Is it just like gore? Is like gore porn redundant? Like torture porn? I guess that's what I'm looking for. Yeah, torture porn. Like, I'm not that interested in watching that, to be entirely honest. Oh, this is Nidorina. So she doesn't have the kick of double. But yeah, Scream. Scream is really good. Scream is really good. If you haven't seen Scream... Oh, she does have double kick. What do I know? Whatever. Um, do you think she has Bite? Wait, 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 wait. Wait. Dre... Did you cook with Knit Arena? What's going on, Dre? I don't think so. Probably not. Yeah, no, no. So we, we're fine. Okay. The Evil Dead I haven't seen. Nice crit. Oh my god, this thing's level 18. What are we doing? Dude, Poison Sting straight up has like an 80% chance to poison. Like, I'm not even doing a bit. Like, it poisons a comical amount of the time. It's absurd. Like, what the fuck? Shaun of the Dead is hilariously bad. Thinking about buying that new Mario Switch. My old Switch is already six years old. Wow, Kama here trying to steer the conversation in a completely different direction. I admire it. <laughs> um, Resident Evil movies? I haven't seen those. I can't imagine that they're actually that good. If I didn't want... If it didn't, it would just be Sting... And somehow Sting is in a Pokemon game seems scarier. Sting's not old. Yeah, I guess Scream is probably my favorite, like, classic horror movie. It's not that old, but, like, that would probably be up there. <coughs> He's 72. Oh, Cabin in the Woods is good. We actually recently watched that. Now that I'm thinking about it, it doesn't make a lot of sense. Um, all right, let's get everybody to 19 and figure out how to beat this guy. Love that I'm actually able to catch a stream. I love it too. Thanks for being here, Wild with a Y. <laughs> oh. Cabin in the Woods, also made by no one. Oh, is wait, really? Is Drew Goddard bad? Oh, A Quiet Place is good. Yeah, but that's not really Halloween-themed. I was thinking Josh Whedon. Josh Whedon. Oh, right, right. Yeah, he had that whole thing. Um, Donnie Darko I don't like. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Zumbi. I'm sure you, you didn't want to hear that, but did not care for it. But uh, Drew Goddard directed The Cabin in the Woods. I think, uh, I think Josh wrote it right um all right so the thing with this voltorb is that we need to make sure that it doesn't explode but the good news is that we can just switch between two ghost types and it'll be uh, between these two until it explodes um cacnea has needle arm sucker punch leer and toxic Needle arm and sucker punch, huh? That's a bit scary. Zubat has wing attack, giga drain, supersonic, and toxic. Also a bit scary. Just kidding. We have magnemite, so that's fine for that. Coughing has sludge bomb, self-destruct, flamethrower, and toxic. Are you kidding me? What the crap? What the crap? 
Okay, I guess damp mudkip would have probably been pretty good there, huh? Damp marsh top specifically for this. Um, Weezing has great defense, bad special defense. Um, I don't know how to bait that. Sludge Bomb and Flamethrower are going to do big damage to this guy. Coughing's giving uh, that one chick. Um, okay, so... Doo -doo 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 -doo. Oh, wait. Why have I not evolved Gyarados? Probably decent for, uh, what's his name? Huh. I guess Cacnea is totally walled by Chicken Man, right? Yeah. Geodude kinda walls coughing, but also not really. Do we bring Ghastly? I wonder how much Ghastly takes from um, Flamethrower on coughing. Probably not a lot. All right, I think we bring Ghastly. So let me let me let me check this. Oh, you know what we could do? Sorry, this is not. I'm I'm still getting used to getting back into the thing swing of things. Do we really not bring the Furret? I guess not. I don't know what fur it does particularly well here. I think we do this. <laughs> Emotional support. True, true, true. But I don't think we have the space for it. Hey. Word. Oh my god, wait. Self-destruct does nothing to Gligar, Glysaur anyways. Maybe we need to not worry about this too much. <laughs> um, what is Glysaur's moves? Although I wonder if this is calced correctly. Do we think this is even calced correctly? Like with the, the half. Blah, 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 blah. Oh my God, we got wide lens, totally forgot. Okay, okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. So yeah, I, I, I still think this is fine. Cacnea is fine. Wheezing, flamethrower, the ghastly. Uh. All right, all right, word. I'm confident with this squad. Let's go like I guess we'll go 19 on them. What's your favorite gen? Probably four or five or three. I don't know. I just named half of them, but. <laughs> All right. Um, shall we do it? Shall we take on Proton? I don't, I haven't done any calcs. Maybe I should just load these up just to be safe. Like I won't do the calcs, but just so we have some. Oh God.
File, open. So let's go import. Import. Tools. Showdown, export party to clipboard. Tools. Showdown, export current box to clipboard. Word. All right, we got our friends here, and we got freaking, freaking, freaking Voltorb over here. Freaking Voltorb. All right, word. Howdy, Flagon. Just finished binging all your ROM hack videos, and now I'm here. Didn't realize you were streaming. Well, thanks for being here, Demon T. Hats off to you. Good luck on your next fight. Thanks. All right. So, yeah, I don't I don't know, Gligar. Gligar. I forgot we had Rock Tomb. We got Rock Smash. Is that worth teaching to Gligar or am I gonna regret that? Oh shit, wait, Rock Smash, we can also teach to the chicken. I mean, am I gonna regret this? Probably not. Where, where is the move deleter in this, Dre? Is it, uh, is Dre still here? Is it in Cyanwood? Cyan wood? Yeah, okay, I'm fine with that. That's like what? One, two, three, four. Yeah, so 29. Okay, I'm, I'm fine with that. I'd rather have that than not have it, you know? Rock smash, rock smash. Do, 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 do. Oh, Voltorb does have self-destruct, but it's fine. All right, so let's take this off. Let's give you... We're going to give you a person berry, or a Pecha berry, excuse me. We're going to give you a Pecha berry. We're going to give you a person berry if we have one. Oh, we have a lumberry. Word. Maybe we should give them all person berries or petcha berries. Yeah, we might as well. Give them all lumberries. Lumberry, lumberry. Do, 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 do. All right, Combuskin, we're also going to give you a Lumberry because everything on this team has Toxic, which is annoying. Um, I don't think we need a Lumberry on you, though. I think we can comfortably give you a Citrus Berry. Although, what's Citrus Berry? It's a... Citrus Berry is 33%, or is that is that not the case? Like, is Orin Berry actually better? In Gen 4, what is it? Because it changes all the time. 25%. So it's actually the exact same because this is 42. Yeah. All right. Um, okay. All right. I'm vibing with this squad. Let's update the layout and go tackle this bad boy. Our very first challenge that can't be swept by Furret. In fact, Furret is nowhere to be seen. Can we do it? The question of the day. 
Um, do we have a prediction going up, mods? Well, it's a little too late for this one, but maybe we can do it for, um, for what's his name? But yeah, always predictions, always predictions. Predictions are good. Nice way to keep people engaged and invested, you know? Um... Look at Combuskin looks so much like a dick. Like it is perfectly shaped like a dick. Anyways, um what was I saying? All right. Let's go Glagar, you and me king. No GB sounds today. Hey, look, bronze on. Uh, we'll do, we'll do, we'll do GB sounds a bit later. All right, all right, King. What do we have here? I am often labeled as the scariest, and blah blah blah. All right. <laughs> no one expects the Spanish Inquisition. Die, sucker. That was a crit. Okay, well. Easy peasy so far, but now we got coughing. Um, I actually don't love that, if I'm being entirely honest. Because it's going to go flamethrower. Or it could just explode. But it looks like we actually live. Even if it crits on both. So, oh wait, never mind, we're at 45. <laughs> no, we still, we still live. So I'm going to stay in. And I'm just going to aerial ace once. What do you do? Yeah, you do do flamethrower. Okay. Okay. So now here's where things get a little tricky potter. Um, I kind of want to go Boingo. Dude, why does this stupid website not work? Nice. Bye. See you, King. Yeah, okay. That did do a shitload of damage. Can I just make sure that... So that did what? 16 damage? Nope. 18 damage? I can do math. Yeah, okay. So... This calc is incorrect. Because it says self-destruct here should do 9 to 11. So this is definitely, it halves your defense. And that's not in the calc here. So that is great to know. Uh, something's still wrong because this says it should still do less. What's going on here? Is coughing... Is coughing adjusted? What's going on here? I just wanna, I wanna get this cleared away so I know going forward, so I don't get screwed later. Coughing, didn't get any buffs. 
Oh wait, it halves your defense, right? Yeah, yeah, okay, yeah, 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 yeah. Jesus, that's terrifying. Yeah, okay, okay. Uh, who's learning what? Furry cutter? I mean, knockoff's kind of shit in this game, but as is furry cutter, isn't it? Do I need furry cutter for anything? I don't think so. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay, so that makes sense. So it does have, but that's not in the calculator. Also, Boingo is almost at the level cap. Cacnea. All right. Cacnea. Um... What do you do to gas leak with needle arm? Still a decent amount. Jesus Christ, gas leak. Come on, buddy. Well, Gasly has nothing else to do, right? Because Magnemity Wall is that. So yeah, we can we can just go Gasly. Um, I'd rather switch in, try and switch in on the Sucker Punch with with uh, the chicken. So let's do it. So are these thirty-three? Oh! You gonna sucker punch me? Save switch. All right, never mind. I don't know. Don't know what he's cooking. Does Ghastly level evolve in this hack? No. Nope. He does not. You have to use a trade item. But I have one, so. Word. All right, we did it. We dusted Proton. Nice miss, loser. Nice miss, loser. Money! Wow, that was a one-shot. Pop off, Magnemity, with your nine special attack IV. You go, girl. Easy. Sick. All right. Proton has been defeated. Um, so now we got to focus on Bugsy, a.k.a. Poopyhead. <laughs> but first, we got to fight all the people that we have to fight. All right. What up, Kurt? I refuse to believe that there's so many people that actually care about the 3DS servers getting shut down. Like, I know some people probably still use it, but like, really? Like, so many people are upset. I have a really hard time believing that people like actually like use it. Like, yeah, kind of, I guess it's sad or whatever, but like, are you kidding me? <laughs> Don't tell me what I can't do, Nintendo. <laughs> All right. Um, let's take on some bug catchers. They'd need to eventually do it. Yeah. I don't know. It's just like, there's a lot of stuff that Nintendo does that I care about. And closing down the servers on a system that I haven't played for 
eight years is not one of them, believe it or not. Um, this is a pretty solid squad for... We'll take, we'll take Didgeridoo as well. Um, I guess instead of Ghastly. I was bummed when they shut down the 3DS eStore. I have a $50 Nintendo eStore card and couldn't use it. Oh, that does kind of suck. What were you going to use it for, though? Can't you also use it on, like, a Switch? Can't wait for the Fire Emblem Awakening remake in 30 years. Fire Emblem Ama Awakening is cracked. Love that game. What a great game. All right. So... Which one is it? It's this one, right? <clears throat> so we get to skip Bugcatcher Al. We get Bugcatcher Benny. A Ladian. Hey, lady! Oh shit, that thing's pretty, pretty strong. Uh-oh. Nah, it should be fine. So this does have Ice Punch, so this makes this a little risky, but we're faster in this one shot, so it's fine. Right? Okay. Phew. Would have been a skosh awkward if that were not the case. Oh shit, he's at the level cap. Run, accordion! Run, my boy, run! Bug bite. All right, you want to eat a lumberry? Buddy boy. Binky boy. Um, whatever. Ah, don't eat it. Accordion is a good girl, sir. Yeah, she is, isn't she? Ain't she? Ain't she? Ooh, acupressure. Dun 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 dun. Oh shit. Uh, speed. Okay, we're fine. To say, don't forget about the heels. Yeah, 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 yeah. Who do you take me for? Some sort of... Oops. Wanna be... Wanna be... Wanna be... Wanna... Wanna person... Huh? Who do you take me for? Um, so it's that way, right? Twins have Illumis, Volbeat, Dustox, and Beautifly. Ooh, boy. Thundershock? They know Thundershock, do they? All right, well... Oh, they're electric type in this game. Look at that. Look at freaking that. Doesn't matter for it. Oh my God, they're pretty strong. Doesn't matter for it.
Doesn't matter for it. Doesn't matter for it. Word. Wow, these things are pretty nutted. 60. 100 defense. Special defense. Wow. 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 All right, so step one, self-destruct. We're going to rock throw Volbeat, and we're going to duh, fire punch Illumise. We're going to do this because I want to kill them both at the same time. That was a crit. Hey. Hey, what are you doing there, guys? What are you doing there, fellas? Uh-huh, 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 uh-huh. Okay, nice, huge, huge. Love to see it, love to see it, love to see it. Bye. Okay. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. You do that. The reason I don't particularly care about that is because Bongo's got a dip anyways, because the uh, Beautifly here has freaking tracking absorb. So we got a dip. We got to make like a mediocre appetizer and dip. Although I think we probably just kill Beautifly here anyways. Ooh, big brain play on dust stocks. Ah. All right, well, we predicted the absorb at least. There's still hope for us yet. All right. All right. All right. Legends Arceus had no replayability and I have no wish to ever return to it. Yeah, fair enough. I do think that that doesn't necessarily make it a bad game. Like there are games that don't really have replayability and I really liked Arceus for what it was, but I do agree, zero replayability. stocks you bastard Ooh! all right we barely made it out of there with our lives guys and gals now it's time for the ultimate challenge uh... All right, word. That's all we have to do, right? We don't actually have to fight that guy, if I remember correctly, right? Right, you turn that off, so it goes like that, then you go like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Okay. Let's go figure out how we're beating Bugsy by first evolving and leveling everybody up. Um, oh shit, Gligar is at level 21, isn't he? So he will disobey, right? Oh, right, and he's got the, uh, the advanced, uh, whatever. Oh well. That was kind of an oopsie daisy, but it is what it is. So we need to keep one person for potential. Well, let's leave Eevee. 
We'll leave Eevee alone. We'll level everybody else up. Um... Follow me, huh? No one needs to follow you. You're the center of the show there, kid. All right. No self promo. <laughs> like and subscribe. Or it said like and subscribe. And sometimes operating the box is so gosh dang clunky. All right, so let's get Gary Dose. Gregory Dose. Oh shit, this learns Dragon Rage? <laughs> okay, <laughs> bet. Wait, does um does Charmander learn anything else good? Nah. Cool, Charmeleon. It'd be really cool if uh, Golbat could evolve, but alas, Earwax. Um, I don't think we need Leech Life here, to be entirely honest. We might as well have Confuse Ray as sort of like a semi-Hail Mary. Organ. All right, let's save him for last. Is Castanets gonna learn it? Oh my God, Crab Hammer at level f Jesus! With wide lens, that's actually huge. Good Lord. Good God, man. Cassinette said, I will not go quietly into the box. He wants to learn bite, huh? Um, I don't think bubbles particularly swell here. Then again, neither is tackle, so we can get rid of tackle. Well, no, yeah, tackle, get rid of tackle. All right, we got Gyarados. Wait a minute. Is this always Intimidate? Okay, okay. <laughs> All right. Let's upload this stuff to the cloud. Uh, I'll open. Tool showdown export party to clipboard and tools showdown export current box to clipboard. All right, import 15 imported correctly. Okay. All right, so let's go to web view. Let me change the title of this bad boy. Calcs! All right, so here's what we're dealing with. Um, 
So these are our tools. And what we're dealing with is this team. Butterfree, Beedrill. Oh, sorry, it's kind of hidden here. How do I, how do we, that's so annoying. Sorry, chat, you're gonna have to go away. So, okay. Butterfree, Beedrill, Yanma, Heracross, Scyther with Swords Dance, and freaking this guy. Um, so, yeah, these are pretty scary. I guess the good news, so Butterfree probably walled by Furret. Like, we can probably just kill with Furret. That brings this guy in. What is with this? Why does this not work sometimes? So if we bring this guy in against Furret, it's going to want to go either Counter or Aerial Ace or Bug Bite. I guess if it goes Aerial Ace, that's not good, but it, I think it'll want to just go Bug Bite. Actually, we survive a hit here, though obviously counters no bueno. Wait, what? Oh, it says it's one. Okay. But if we go then to Zubat. Wing attack is a one shot. We don't have speed, though. Aerial Ace can crit kill. But if we go Drifloon, Gust is a two shot, and then we can guarantee the, uh, we can activate the berry. Um, then that brings in Yanma. You go AP, which is scary, but we can go Geodude. See, what's wrong with this calc? Yanma doesn't do much to this. Rock throw is a one shot. It'll obviously U-turn out, potentially, but that gives us free damage onto this guy. Vital throw always moves last, right? We can two shot with rock throw, potentially. Well, not exactly two shot. Um, and then Beedrill. Oh, is Cut Grass-type in this game? Dre, you sneaky son of a gun. This is walled by Magnemity. Sorta. Scyther, sorta. Thundershock. We can also T-wave it, which, is, which would be huge. So what I want to do is I want to bring... So what are the obvious ones to bring? Is there anything better than Furret? Lead. Like... I think we can also get Charcoal, right? Can't I buy Charcoal from Azalea Town? Oh, is that only in gold and silver? You get rid of that? Bruh! You have to battle the rival. Shit. Shit. Okay. Um, I'm honestly fine with Butterfree setting up Rain Dance, though. I don't really care about that. Um... I still think Fur it's the best lead. Unless I can find a way to kill Butterfree quickly. Like if I had Gligar. Oh, Glysaur. Gly oh, right. Gligar is not a good bring here um, because it's all silly. Yeah, that would have been nice, huh? Um, What about Charmeleon? Nar. 
What about crab hammer core fish? Motherfucker just crushes through with crab hammer. Yo, let's let let's let them set up the rain for core fish and then just have him eviscerate. <laughs> Geodude, I don't want to bring out because Geodude's too good to lead with, um, and he only has limited amount. But I so I think Furret is the play. Um, what about Gyarados? How fast are you, Gyarados? 39, so you do have... Zero iv Gyarados. Great. Fantastic. Come on. What if you're at 1%? Flail kills. Flail just outright kills. But then I don't think you're faster than anything else. Aether's at 55, damn, man. Um, so Flail Gyarados would do it. Um, Anything else? So yeah, no, I think, I think Furret's the lead. We go Furret, take out Butterfree with Fire Punch and or bring it down to very low. Um, if it sets up Rain Dance, so be it. If it U-turns, also so be it. I don't really care. That brings in this guy. Um, and so you are dealt with by Drifloon. Sort of. Do you know if Bug Bite eats the berry, does that give it Unburden? That should still work, right? I suppose Gara walls this pretty well too, right? The berry needs to proc? Really? Ugh. It should never go Aerial Ace here. It will either go Counter or Bug Bite. Oh. Gongus, you're giving me misinformation, Chief. That's fine. But yeah, um, what's his name? Walls this fine. Bug Bite still does a surprising amount of damage for being quad resisted, yeah? Um, okay, so whatever. Kill that, you come out, Geodude walls you. AP is definitely scary, but I, I guess with Unburden, it'll probably want to detect anyways, right? Um... So then what is my what are my other answers? So this comes in Pincer on Geodude is a little sketchy because of Vital Throw. Fury Attack, knock off and bind into that's decent into you though. Yeah. You don't have a U-turn. Knock off a little scary. But it won't actually see that knockoff. Oh, but... Mm. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> Alright, um, so Scyther. Jesus, that still does so much. U-turn? How do we bring Scyther out? Unfortunately, it's last for the most part, right? So once it gets U-turn set up, that's pretty lousy. It's a wing attack, so, but, mm. So like against Combuskin, we can bring it out early. If we have Combuskin, bring it out early. Uh, 
Um, Scyther comes out, sees the kill with wing attack, gives me a safe switch into you. Para with Thunder Wave, which never misses in this game, and then three Thunder Shocks should do it. Um, if a U turns out, we're still gonna have to play around some crits. That's insane, man. Dre, is um is Para still a quarter in this game? I'd imagine so, right? So if we go Busk, Busk and Gera, U-turn still shouldn't do that much to Gera either, yeah. Uh, a rogue wing attack would obviously be scary, but U-turn here, and then it's Parad. So we outspeed. Yeah, 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 this should be fine. If we go Gera and Busk. I think that gives us enough answers. Gera's also good into you. Sorta. Of. Okay. We have enough AP answers, like if Yanma gets an AP boost into Geodude, it still just goes for U-turn or air cutter. This th that could be scary, but it's only one rock throw needed. U-turn, that's a crazy amount of damage for U-turn, 17.6%. <clears throat> All right, and, and mag, mag walls this as well, pretty easily. Um, okay. So the only other potential would be like Corfish to dick swing around crab hammers like nobody's business, but... I don't think he's strong enough for that, unfortunately. Like, he takes too much damage from Air Cutter. Jesus. Yeah. Sorry, Corefish. Sorry, Fishy Boy. Um, Buskin versus Charmeleon. Combuskin baits the wing attack. Which I like. Dragon Rage, though. 85, 24, 80, 21. Wow. Wait, is Combuskin just all around better? It's slower. Less spadef. Wow. Um, okay. I think this is fine then. Um, we'll need to watch out. No, this should be fine. Okay. Um, I think these are the three, six I'm going to bring. I'm going to bring Magnemity. Didgeridoo, Drifloon, Bongo, Bassoon, and Combuskin. Um, knockoff is not 65 base power in this game. It's 20, which is nice. Um, so that didn't happen until Gen 6 or whatever. I think these are up to Gen 5. Um, it would be nice to bring this guy, but I screwed the pooch and leveled him up to 21. I think he's too much of a liability otherwise. Um... Scyther, the other question is I could bring Zubat. Ah, uh, no, nah, it's too risky. Quick Attack does too much damage. I also forgot that Quick Attack was a thing still. Okay. Could get out of hands. Scyther definitely could still get out of hands. Out of hand. But we'll see what we can do. All right, I'm going to go to the bathroom. Um, then we'll like edge everything. I think what we'll probably need to do is get Drifloon to a certain amount where a non-crit Aerial Ace guarantee puts it into unburden range or something. Otherwise, well, I'll, I'll, I'll think about that. that. That'll have to be something to figure out, but I will be right back. You guys want to see something funny? Because of the green screen thing, Subby's all all gray. Because I use a green screen now for that thing. So Subby's gray. But here's a gray Subby sub stream. I'll be back in a sec.
All right. So now that I'm thinking about it, I wonder if Heracross can be better dealt with in some other way. Mainly because I don't really want to give Yanma the option to Omni Boost. So if we can bait it into using something else, I would much prefer that. Like Air Cutter, for example. Um, like, so, oh man, Bug Bite really does a lot of damage still. It's 60, yeah. Magnemite, 23.2. Magnemite's really good into this guy, so I don't necessarily want to piss that away. Oh, also Scyther, we actually need Magnemite for Scyther. Geodude was the one that I've got for, uh, for Yamma. But, yeah, I guess there is no other option, really. Charmeleon? Uh, Aerial Ace does too much. Dragon Rage is a two-shot, and we are faster. Hold on. But then who do I sacrifice? I sack... No, you still have the air cutter or ancient power problem, so it doesn't matter. Um, it would have to be Combuskin, and I don't think Combuskin... Peck is a two-shot, but we're not fast. We're not even close. Marielis does obviously too much damage, so I think that may be our best bet. Okay. Okay. Okay, fine. You win! How much does Scyther do? Jesus Christ. All right. Um, great. So... I think the default is Citrus Berry for everybody, but let me see if anybody else makes sense. Um, we won't give it to, to Drifloon quite yet. So does, does Citrus, does anything else make sense on any of these Pokemon? I have, what else do I have? I have Lumberry and I have Wide Lens. Oh, uh, the Beedrill is also still an issue. This is, this is going to be tight. This is going to be a very tight, tight fight. Um, I could also XP share for free dam uh, King's Rock we've got, but that's rather have citrus berry the wide lens the only question then is wide lens on geodude is that worth it that makes rock throw 99 percent togepi egg didn't hatch yet oh wait sorry here i'm i'm over here I guess if Geodude, if Yanma... So what's more likely? So Citrus Berry we would only need if AP gets an Omni Boost and then Yanma crits. And even then, it actually doesn't matter. So, I think it's... I'd rather have Wide Lens than Citrus Berry, I think. That makes things... Oh, I guess, you know what? No, 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 no. Even at plus one defense, Rock Throw kills. That's, that's good to see. 
Yeah, this is sketchy though. Um, all right, yeah, wide lens on dude, citruses on everything else. So, yeah, Jolteon would be a real big help here, honestly. <laughs> <laughs> um, but it is what it is. So now my question is, how do I best deal with this hair cross situation? So let's assume for it kills Butterfree. Hair cross comes in. It could counter, but it could also just bug bite. If it bug bites, then what? Heracross bug bites. Heracross Bug Bites, I can go to Drifloon, and then he eats our Citrus Berry, so it's fine. If he goes Aerial Ace, then I just kind of have to hope that he doesn't crit. I think we stay at full HP, though. I don't think we I don't think we do anything fancy with, like, lowering, because it's, 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 it's hard to tell. He might also just counter. I don't want to needlessly be in crit range. Although, I guess... Yeah, I guess it's a little questionable if he counters because then we're not in crit, right? We, we risk a crit. Um, I guess that's okay, you know? If you put worthless berries on your Mon, will that bait bug bite? Um, maybe. I don't know, actually. I don't really want him to eat my berry, though, if I can avoid it. I think it's still better to be at full HP. The one question, it's just I don't know if he goes bug bite or if he goes counter. He probably goes bug bite. All right, let's 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 do this. I'm not going to I'm not going to change Drifloon at all. But this is definitely going to be Toit. Uh well, it depends. It depends. This could definitely be Toit. Salabatron 300. Thank you for the sub via Prime. I really appreciate it. Um, do, 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 Two, four, set, view. Man, man. Set, view. Twenty-two, six, set. Okay, export. All right. Bam, bam. All right, let's drop him off in the box so we don't have another uh, fiasco on our hands from uh, Furret.
All right. Oh, Ferret, you are so cute. Is that the appropriate attack? It should be. 86 attack. change the uh, whole freaking layout. Thank you for the sub, Yami Sukaniro. Cheers to ya. And then this just goes Gera. All right. Uh, I think that's the team, right? Yeah. All right. Here goes something. Okay. Oh, speed boost on Combuskin would be so nice here. <laughs> All right. That's Pokétuber, hands down. Aww. Woo! No speed boost for you, only relaxed blaze. Yeah. It do appear like that, Dre. Bum 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 ba bum bum ba bum bum. Bum 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 ba bum bum bum. Call me Zach. Hey yo, this is my first stream. I love your videos, man. Thank you. Thanks for being here. Hope you're having a good time. Oh boy. Oh boy. All right, Bugswell. What is Bugsy's name short for? Bugsworth? Bugathy? Oh, okay. Here we go. Let's start that high roll. Let's start things off hot with a high roll on the free. Oh, never mind. That is a 6% chance to kill. <laughs> All right, here we go. What up, Bugsworth? I'm Bugsy. I never lose when it comes to Bug-type Pokemon. My research is going to make me the authority on Bug-type Pokemon. But let me demonstrate what I've learned from my studies. All right, Bugsy. Um, all the punches have a 10% chance of happening, right? Bum, 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 bum. Yeah, it's all 10%. So, we go with the Ice Punch Freeze. Right here. Right here. Right here. We get the freeze. Oof. Rain Dance, perfect. Okay, totally easy. Now you're gonna waste a healing item. What, do you, what does he have, two healing items? Um, And what is it? Is it Super Potions? It's Moo Moo Milk. Ooh. Dre, you're gonna look huge. Huge. Thank you, Dre. Because if it's, um, if it's freaking, basically I want to stall out turns of the rain dance just, in, just so that Heracross might have a chance to 
Set it up again. I guess it doesn't actually matter because Heracross is coming out second. This is impossible information to find. It looks like it's just one super potion, right? Da -da -do -da -do -da. Looks like it's one Moo Moo Milk. Moo Moo Milk. That's adorable. Bum, 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 bum. All right. Bum, 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 bum. All right, bye, Butterfree, as they say. All right, didgeridoo up to level 22. We're at full HP, which is lit. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. So it should either go counter or bug bite here. One of the two. Ideally, it goes... Well, I guess ideally it goes bug bite. Uh, I don't know. We'll see. But I think either way, we go bagpipes. Bagpipes. <laughs> bagpipes here with the bug bite. Okay, so it eats my berry. So theoretically, that's good. Theoretically, I should now be faster. and I can gust. Great. So that's gonna aerial ace if it knows what's good for it. And you're not gonna crit. Okay. 86. So now let me just think this through. Is there any way to get around reasonably this thing? Yanma coming in and clicking AP. I don't think so, unfortunately. Okay, but actually it doesn't see the kill on AP, so ideally it goes detect because we're faster. Be nice if we could just one shot. If we played if we didn't play around crit, we could. Uh, we could just stay in, but all right, let's go let's go just here. And get the kill. Okay. All right, please detect. Please detect. I do not want to deal with your buffoonery. Stock Pile. Ooh, that's set up, though. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Show me Yanma. I would really appreciate you not getting the AP boost here, Queen. Bongo, right? I think we do bongo here. Yeah, I guess we could go didgeridoo. Didgeridoo. Didgeridoo doesn't one shot either. Hmm. All right, we go bongo. Detect. Detect. Detect, detect, detect. Shit. Okay, but air cutter's fine. That's, that's, yeah, 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 that's totally fine. Um, an air cutter doesn't flinch at crits, so it's gonna probably U-turn here. No, it just detects. Interesting. Very, very interesting. Yeah, stall out your own reign. Whatever. U-turn, okay. Shoot, how much does this do? Uh, ooh. All right, well, we get a free hit on Pincer, which is fine. Mold Breaker. Okay. Wait. What? Rock Throw does 44 to 55%. It's a 43% chance to kill. I could stay in here. But I think that's stupid. Um, the thing I'm a little concerned about is um, I'm 
Vital Throw also doesn't kill unless it high rolls, um, but it, it could crit. So my question then is, will it want to see the knockoff? Like, do we know if the AI is really weird about knockoff in this game? Does anybody have any, Dre, do you have any ideas? Or Gongus? Like, does it see the thing and want to go knockoff? Because I could go Drifloon, which honestly is kind of potentially still the play because we are we don't have an item anymore. So knockoff does. How does that do 20%? How does that do 24 to 30%? That's insane. Okay, never mind. Maybe we don't go that. Maybe we go Didger. No, we can't go Didgeridoo. This is exactly the same. It's uh, it doesn't see a kill here, or it shouldn't see a kill. We could also just rock throw. <laughs> if the AI has at least thirty percent HP and it is not their first turn in battle, then they have a twenty-seven percent chance of plus one score. What? Okay, well, it doesn't have 30% HP. Oh, it does have 30% HP. Oh, I could risk Drifloon here. Although, mm, maybe I just go Gera. Yeah, I mean, Gyarados is fine here. Gyarados does bring back in... What's his name? If it sees kill, it with will something else it won't. What? So it doesn't see the kill here on Geodude except for one high roll of Vital Throw. How well does Busk take that? Um, not great, 47 to 58%, so crit. Oh, wait, 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 wait. 31 to 37%, yeah, we could get knocked off here and then Ember is enough for the kill, but we're not faster, but it doesn't matter because Vital Throw is last. So we could go Busk. Um, and then that does bait Air Cutter again. Okay, I don't hate that. What was Bus going to be used for? This, right? So yeah, okay, we could we could we could do Bus. Vital Throw does go last, right? I'm not mistaking that. Knock off is fine. Okay, okay, I do like Bus actually. And Ember, Ember doesn't guarantee a kill, but if it vital throws here, should be fine. Should be fine. Okay. All right, let's go Busk. Vital. Okay, it did go vital throw, so we were safe too, but that's fine. Yeah, it's 20 damage. Vital throw does at most. Okay, a high roll crit will actually kill, and Ember does 44 to 55% but I'm still going to roll it here. So it's at, if it's in the yellow, it should be right around 29, which is most rolls. I'm gonna, I'm gonna Ember here. Nice, okay, it doesn't care about uh, Vital Throw. Uh, knockoff. It simply does not care about Knockoff. All right, Bongo's at level 22. Rollout's actually pretty tight. What if I just roll out swept this whole ass thing? Is that low-key a play? Bring in Yanma and just roll out? I think I think Geodude's taking too much damage from, from what's-his-name. That's definitely not a play. But does rollout even one-shot at plus one, or at one, against Yanma at 22? It does. So what if I rolled out? Yeah, it is. It's obviously risky, and I think I need G Dude for. Uh, well, I don't know. It's, it's not going to be Graveler, so I don't know how good G Dude is for uh, for Mill Tank. 
I mean for uh, Whitney, but um, I mean Beedrill comes out next anyways. Oh, and it's got cut. Yeah, so hard pass on that. All right, all right. Okay, Yanma it is. Busk, Yanma. Yanma always goes air cutter here. That's a safe switch back into Geodude. Ooh, it's tight. Uh, this is gonna be tight. I think I may have to risk Geodude to a crit here. Is there any world where I go uh, for it? Air cutter is twenty-one to twenty-five. I actually want to. I actually want to go. I actually want to go. Go for it here. Oh, shouldn't for it. Uh, one shot. Beedrill. Wait, that's huge. That's huge. Okay. 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 Can we do this? We air slash. Yeah, 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 yeah. Bird sweep. All right, didgeridoo. Come on out, buddy. Okay. Now we just fire punch. Oh, we're faster? Wait. Why did speed boost not go off? Is it not speed boost? Wait. And didgeridoo with the high roll? Yo? Bueller? Didgeridoo? All right, all right, all right. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. I want to be careful here. I, I kind of want to switch. Is that stupid? Because I don't want Scyther to get a free, a free boost. Because right now, he does not see the kill on Furret. We're speed tied, too. Like, do I switch to Mag Magneton right now on Beedrill? I think I, I, I think I honestly do. Like, it's kind of stupid, but I think I have to. It definitely goes U-turn. U-turn hits a pretty... Does pretty good damage into Magnemity. But I... I it... it I... Mm. Yeah, I really, I really don't want to have Scyther get a free Swords Dance. I think I have to switch. I think we go Theremin. This is risky, though. Okay, that's fine, actually. Okay. I don't know why it went Twin Needle instead of U-Turn. But now I want to Thunder Wave it. There we go. Perfect. Perfect. We're going to get a free Thunder Wave off. Ooh, that is... Oh, okay. So I think a crit here kills me.
But that's super clutch. We just got that off. Crit U-turn kills me here. But then I win the game. I go didgeridoo and fire punch, fire punch. So I think it's kind of worth it. It would be really bad to lose Magnemite here, but the alternative... Wait, 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 wait. Can I go... Can I go Gyarados? No. Um... I think I risk the crit right here. Cause I think it's gonna I think it's gonna swords dance anyways. And then if it swords dances I'm still in a bit of trouble. I guess I can go Gyarados. Okay, okay, let's try it. Let's Thundershock here. Yeah. Okay. All right. Plus two, homie. You're a plus two. Um. I really needed to U turn here. Now it should see the kill. It always sees the kill. So we go Gyarados at plus one U-turn doesn't do much. Okay, okay, okay. If it goes wing attack here, I, I don't know why I did that, but so be it. So we go Bassoon here. U-turn. U-turn. U-turn, you crazy kid. Shit! That's okay, that's okay. So now it's gonna go wing attack. Geodude, how much does Geodude take from plus one? Plus one wing attack does 31 to 39%. Jesus, Geodude, you garbage motherfucker. Okay, so Geodude's a no-go. If I go Magnemity... Oh, he's still 21. Okay, 21, 21. Plus one wing attack. Also does 25 to 30%. I think I'm, I'm risking a crit regardless here. It's either Mag or Geodude. Oh my god, I guess if it Swords Dances again, I'm in so much trouble. I think because of that, I have to go Geodude. Scyther, or so Magnemity did at minimum 36. So if I go Geodude, and as long as it doesn't crit, stay in? No, I, I, I don't stay in. Gyarados can't do anything. It's a plus one. Wing attack crit kills here. I'd rather lose Geodude. I think I have to go Geodude. Paraflinch, yeah, I could, I could do Paraflinch, but this has a Citrus Berry, but it does like 12%. Um, if I 
If I get in relatively for free, like if it's swords dances or whatever, then I could just straight up kill with you, dude. I think I go dude. I'm gonna go dude, dude. Yeah, okay, don't crit, don't crit, don't crit. Okay. Okay, so now I think I just take the kill. Wait, 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 wait. Let's make sure I'm faster. Oh, we're speed tied! Oh! Because <laughs> we're zero speed IVs, of course. If we had one speed IV, we would be faster. We would be faster. One speed IV, we would be faster. Yeah, I'm level 22. Ah. Uh. Wing attack always kills here. So does U-turn. So it's going to be a 50-50. I could go Gyarados. It'll be neutral and hope that it U-turns. Then we're at neutral, then we can go Theramin. And then be, be okay. Yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, so back to Dose. We're neutral now. Perfect. Perfect! Okay, okay. Okay. Why is that perfect? Um... Okay. So he's gonna wanna go Sludge Bomb here and or Twin Needles or Cut, doesn't really matter. He should not use U-Turn here. Um, does Didgeridoo survive the bomb? Didgeridoo always survives the bomb. So as long as he doesn't U-turn here, Didgeridoo is good. All right. Wait, what? Wait, 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 wait. This is not as free as I thought it was. Ah, shit. This site there is still going to fuck me up. All right, all right, all right. So I go didgeridoo, brings it down. Scyther sees the kill with wing attack. Free switch on neutral Scyther to Magnemity. Activate Citrus Berry, Thundershock, two kills. Maybe, maybe that works. It's tight, but let's do it.
Okay, perfect. Okay. This would be great if I could get to level 22 on um, on Magnemity, but I don't know if it works like that. A Gyarados 22, that's nice. It does not work like that, damn it. Okay. But now, Homeboy sees... Wing attack. Use the kill on wing attack. Always sees the kill with wing attack here. So this gives us a safe-ish switch to Magneton. Not really, but kind of. Um, I just risk it. I just risk it. Thundershock twice. Full para. Let's see a full para here. Full para here. Full para. 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 Oh, what? So it's 25% of 66. God, we're so close. We're so close. I, I win this. It's just whether I lose something. So this has another 16 HP. So this is effectively 66. This effectively has 16 plus 66. What is that, 82? Eighty-two. So this has 82 HP. Thundershock is an 8.4% chance to three hit KO. So I don't love that. So yeah, it's pretty unlikely here. All right, what are my options? My options are to go for Thundershock, but then uh, -tur if I miss out on the kill, U-turn kills because then it'll be in Swarm. It should not be in Swarm yet. If it is, then then I'm pretty much golden to get, like, but... If it goes Wing Attack, I can go Bassoon. Then it's minus one. But of course, we're risking massive crits. Bite will two hit kill. Or maybe it won't even. Fuck. It's swarm. Oh, it's technician. You're right. You're right. You're right. You're right. You're right. So. Actually, what? Magnemite is, a, is lives a non-crit. Always here. All right, given that, given that Magnemite lives a non-crit here, I stay in. I absolutely stay in. I risk the crit here. It's crit through para. 
Fortunately, wing attack still crit kills, unless it low rolls. All right, Mag, buddy. Pull through here. Wait, 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 wait. Also... No, no, no. Thundershock always does more. All right, Mag. Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. I don't throw here though, it has quick attack. <laughs> Let's go! Does, does crit wing attack kill Gyarados? 66. High roll. One high roll crit kills Gyarados. Let's do it. Let's freaking do it. Just quick attack. Just fucking quick attack, please. Ah! <laughs> ah! Should we bubble it down? Bubble for the dub? I don't, I don't want to risk it. Go for the bite! Oh! Oh! It did get fully paralyzed once. It was just at a horrible time. Lord have mercy on this heart of mine. Let's go. So. Woo. All right, so we had to risk a couple crits. And actually, I don't think Scyther crit once, which is incredibly lucky. Um, yeah, that was, whew, that was tight. I don't know if I had any other outs at that point. With hindsight, ha it having gone for U-turn, I still don't think it matters. Um, I think, honestly... The Beedrill... I think I think that's where I screwed up. The Beedrill. If I had just killed the Beedrill, what happens? Didgeridoo is at full HP, right? Or like nearly full, so Scyther doesn't see the kill. Sets up Swords Dance and then I'm fucked. Because then it's permanent Swords Dance up. It's one of the harder bits in the game. We'll see about that. 24 is the new level cap, I do declare. Lord almighty. Okay. Jesus Christ.
Are you using hard caps like you did in Renplat? Um, no, just gym leader caps. Um, gym leader caps and no EVs and no setup. I think that's plenty hard enough. Okay. Okay. Rival fight next. Yeah, mods, if you want to make a quick prediction for rival fight, we'll do that. And then that might be the end of the stream. We'll see. We'll see how we're doing with time. It's already 447. So the rivals got Murkrow, Ghastly, Kadabra, and Quillava. Interesting. Guy, he's got a freaking Kadabra. That's lousy. But they're only level 21. <laughs> Wrong one. Oh, well, I guess Magnemite just eviscerates. Okay, yeah, this this should be fine. Are you getting a Ladybod? They are really cool here as well. I don't know. I might go for the guaranteed Poliwag. Rival beat Bugsy with a Kadabra. Yeah. <laughs> uh, We don't have a Dark type yet, huh? The Kadabra, a little scary, although I guess we do have Magnemite. <laughs> well, Kadabra still does a lot of damage. But Kadabra's only 50. You know who's faster than freaking Kadabra? For it. Oh wait, I guess we could get Umbreon right now, right? Because Eevee goes 23 and then evolves. Yeah, I'm fine with that. Nope, we never leveled him up. Sad. Poor king. Um, yeah. He's only got four Pokemon. Let's not overthink this. Uh, leads Murkrow. Furret kills. Oh, no, he doesn't. You know who Furret does do well into, though? Mother freaking Ghastly. Ghastly! Yachi! Um. Ain't it fun living on my own? Don't go crying to your mama. Are we doing rival? Yeah. Yeah, bro. Oh, wait. We also have Gyarados for Kadabra, so I think we're um, okay. Okay. Yeah, let's not, let's not, just in case we change our mind about Eevee. Let's not piss away Eevee, like, into the wind, you know? Um, all right. Magnemity takes care of Murkrow. That brings out Quillava. We switch to, I don't know, Corfish. How's Corfish doing to Quillava? Is that hilarious or is that hilarious? Oh, look at that. Crab hammer with the one shot, baby. Easy. Easy money. Quillava doesn't got shit on my boy Corfish. Um, Ghastly wall by that. Yeah, profit. Okay.
Are you the reason I was listening to Paramore the other day? How would that possibly be possible? <laughs> All right, Corefish, don't fuck this up, King. I believe in you, big boy. Bless you, sweet child. Bless you. All right, Rival, Rival Fred, or what is his name? Skipper, Scooter, Scooty, Skippy Dippy. All right, Drifloon, get out of here. Make way for a real king. Friggin' Corfish. Corfish, Corfish, Corfish. <sighs> Where the fuck is Corfish? Oh, there he is. Corfish, Corfish, Corfish. Yeah, looks good to me. Full send. Corvish, Corvish, Corvish. All right. Doubters, get your doubts in now, quick. Prediction's about to close. All right. Here we go. Is it true that Team Rocket has returned? I don't know. Google it. Are you serious? Then let's see how good you are. What a freaking virgin. What a freaking little virgin. Doon, doon. Pursuit. I did not care for that. That was a lot of damage there, Chief. My Chief. Don't do that. Don't do that. I don't like it. No me gusta. Don't do it again. Thank you. Goodbye. Bye. Bye bye. Bye bye now. Bye bye. All right. Will lava. This looks like a job for Corfish, Corfish, Corfish. <laughs> Corfish, Corfish, Corfish. You have one way that you can blow this, Corfish, and that's getting burned, so don't let it happen. Corfish, Corfish! Corfish, Corfish, Corfish! Corfish, Corfish! Corfish! We got him! <laughs> hey, good job, Castanets! Good job, Castanetties. Castanets. Fuck it, we ball. Let's stay in. Corfish, my new ride or die bro. Crab hammer gets the one shot, folks. We ominous wind never kills unless it crits. Fuck it, we ball. <laughs> no. All right. All right. Okay, Corfish could have taken that. What a dick. What a didgeridildo. Absolute douche nozzle over here. All right, well, that's that. I have suffered the curse. The curse is real. Oh, we don't waste a citrus berry, did you redo? Also, why are you divisible by four? Why is your max HP divisible by four? That's very unoptimal. All right, Kadabra. 
Bassoon! Ha ha ha, defense drop. I mean, intimidate. Ha ha. Oh, disable, huh? I'll disable you. Oh, man. Okay, this is how he wins. He kinesis it. He kinesis a win. Never mind. Scratch that. Watch it have charge beam for some reason. Yeah, that could be bad. But he didn't. It's fine. We good. Victory is ours. I'm curious how many people doubted. Not that many. Someone, nobody, nobody banked on wipe, huh? They think they are big and tough as long as they are in a group. Ah, yes. All right. Now we have to decide. What is it? It's almost five. We have to decide what to get from Ilex Forest. And to be honest with you guys, I think I want to get the guaranteed wag. I see no downside in getting the guaranteed wag. Carnivine hype? Can't even get carnivine. Oh, 5% at night? <laughs> of course, if I get Poliwag and it's not the ability, then it's a big boner kill. Wag is guaranteed in Ecrotech. Check Ecrotech. Ah, uh, yeah, Wag is my only is my only encounter in Ecrotech. Hmm. All right. Well. That changes literally everything. Literally everything. We're not doing it. All right, we ain't getting wagged. That's nice. I don't really want to have to buy repels. So, um, okay. So then what's the encounter? I don't think there's a repel manip for the forest. At least one that's not being mentioned in the repel manips. So, shroomish, 20%. Oh, we're not going, not, uh, we are not going at night. I am not risking getting a freaking Paris again. Even in Paris, I'm gonna wait for my parents. We found out. All right, Parasite did get more attack and defense, but still. I mean, I guess we do get Spore, but still. I think Shroom is pretty dope. Shroom. Yeah, Morning would give me Shroom, Ladybop, Pineco, Execute, Baneary, Budu, Pikachu, Butterfree, Beedrill, Roselia. And I think all of those are better than switching the bugs out for Wormpole. Yeah. I don't really want Ladybot, to be honest, but we're not getting Carnivine, guys. Um... I want Shroom. Do I have a way to bait out anything? Not really, huh? Delayed until 2050. <laughs> yeah, you do that, King. All right, let's get Shroom. Is Ladybaw really better than Wormpole? Were the, were the other bugs buffed? Like at this point, I don't know if Ladybaw is any, any, any good anymore. We're already pretty into the game. Then again, I don't think dust stocks or beautify is doing anything too hot either, huh? Ladian might get mock punch for Whitney. 
So... I mean, I guess it's, it's good if we can... Like, it's just hard to switch it in. Um... Let's see what the others... Did, did the others get some Buffy Duffies? Beautifly got more special attack, more special defense, and more speed. And got Shield Dust as an ability. That's pretty cracked. And Dustox got the ability Compound Eyes. That's interesting. Interesting choice. Um, and it got Protect. Although, if the TMs are any different, are the same, then we'll get them anyways but all right what whatever we'll go uh i mean worm pulls a toss-up between beautifly and dust stocks do i have any bug types no i do have a shitload of flying types and but i also have a shitload of poison types so whatever let's just let's just go early in the morn and uh call it yeah where's that where's the damn zoo bat get over here zoo daddy or should I say Zubatty? <laughs> Zubatty is a baddie. All right, here. All right. Ladian could look stylish. Very true. Here, let's go. When does when does AM start? Like eight? Is eight count as the morning? Is it morning time at 8 AM? 4 a.m. to 10 a.m. All right. Oh, wait. Move! Oh, freaking old man with his bullshit. Tanga berries. Very useless. Okay. 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 Yeah, 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 yeah. Surprise, far fetched, Mr. Steal Your Duck. What if we just steal the far fetched? You found a farfetch. Thank you, but there's still one missing. Must I do everything, King? I guess so. Um, why am I not? There we go. All right, what did we get? What did we get? We got. Huh. Shit. That's rare, I guess. Oh, I got electric type again. Oh, these home these homies got freaking these homies got buffed. Damn. Damn! All right, Pikachu, what is his moveset at level 16? What's the ability? Uh, Lightning Rod. So I don't think that works in this game though, right? It also doesn't know Thundershock, so that's fun. <laughs> One, two, three, four. Dad gum. All right, I'll just put it to sleep.
I mean, it's not, it doesn't work. Fastball doesn't work. I think it's like 100 speed, but kind of cool. Go fastball. It's very on, on brand. One ball HG, baby. All right, Gongus, what musical instrument is Pikachu? And if you say electric guitar, you're banned because that's lame. It raises its tail to check its surroundings. The tail, it's sometimes struck by lightning in this pose. Electric violin, zither, bass, bass, sitar. Gongus, you get to pick. Triangle kind of makes sense. Bass. All right. His name is Bass. Like the pro shop? Do you think there's ever just like... Like rock and roll artists that go to, to, to Bass Pro Shop and get very confused? Um... Cool. Well, I'll be honest. Not, was I, not what I was expecting. We got Pikachu. It's like a 5% encounter, I guess. Oh, good, a revive. I could have taken the 20% shroomish, but that's just me. Literally me going to a popular sporting goods store. Yeah. Uh, it could have been worse. Could have gotten Baneri, I guess. Uh, how do you do this one again? That's right. Get out of here. There's my shroomish. Hello, fellow shroomish. Why are they all now just coming out of the woodworks? Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, word. Let's go get charcoal from this man. What? I thought they give you charcoal. Oh, here we go. Word. Okay, word. Um, doom, 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 doom. Okay, so let's get to Goldenrod. I don't know. I'm feeling sporty. I'm feeling like that Spice Girl. So Route 34 has Drowsy, Gulpin, Electrike, Bonsly, Mime Jr., Abra, Ditto, Snubble, and Kadabra. Or... Get this, we could old rod for a 60% chance at Goldeen, huh? I know I can manip for Kadabra, but I manipped for Gibble and it bit me in the ass and Kadabra will have teleport. So... I don't know, Chief. It's lightning rod, damn it. Um, at least it's um not a terrible nature. It's not a great nature, but that's not horrible. Huh? Oh, you can get ditto here. That's ultra ultra shit. Um, all right, who can learn cut? Tentacool can learn cut, right? 60 base power, Dre. Dre, you sneaky son of a gun. A grass move on Combuskin, huh? Mmm... I guess Corfish can learn Cut, probably, right? Doesn't even make sense for it to be grass. Well, you made your bed. We have the ultimate 
gra uh, water answer. Although something tells me that crab hammer will still be more damage. I don't think we need bubble. I go steal these days. Yeah, I suppose that makes sense. It'd be pretty wild to just give everybody a steal move. All right. Um, what's the level cap? Twenty-four. Time to buy some repels so I don't have to do this whole thing. Ooh, should I get headbutt for Furret? Or somebody? Anybody? Probably Gyarados. Can we get Spiky or Pichu? Can we get Celebi? Whoa, what is that? Is that for Leafeon? Oh, hey, it's Gardenia. Is she gonna battle me? That's for Leafeon? You know, you could have used a Leaf Stone. <laughs> Um, uh, um, um, <laughs> okay. <laughs> Well, Dre, I gotta say you've come a long way, but it's it's fa fascinating to see your roots. <laughs> oh, interesting. Very, very interesting. Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed. What? Um, I don't know if I want headbutt. I don't know if I want to get rid of the punches. Nah. Nah, these are all better. We Gucci. All right. Uh, Adsvik, thank you so much for the three months via Prime. Folks, did you know that if you have Amazon Prime, you can link your Prime account to your Twitch account and subscribe for free? Pretty awesome. Takes money from Jeffrey Bezos, puts it in my pocket. Pretty wild stuff. Pretty wild. Good job for it. Da -da 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 -da. Get back here, Furret. Get in line, buddy. Thank you. I found an either. All right, we've made it. Um, if I'm gonna do the whole cadaver thing, I might as well get some ultra ball. Ooh, a Motham. Look at you, you sneaky dog. Oh, honey, you're making a Pokedex? What is this, taunt? Oh, is Cynthia? I'm scared to talk to Cynthia. Can we avoid her? What did, what did young Dre do to Cynthia? I, I can only imagine. Uh, run! Ah, oh, crap. Well, hello, Mati. I had a feeling I might see you pass through here. You're probably wondering why I'm even here, question mark. I found an odd little artifact that I felt like you might somehow be able to use. It's known as an odd keystone. Have we met? Did I already meet Cynthia? You know, Jesus died for our Cynthias. Here, you can have it. Yeah, I don't... Eh, we already we already got our encounter. It's the Combuskin. Okay, honestly, though, Combuskin did, did, did great. 
Oh, right. She did give me an Eevee, I remember. Word. All right. Wow. All I can say is wow. Wow. What is this? Emerald Kaizo? Uh, do I have the ability to beat this? Uh, probably. Probably. Sure. Don't do it. Um, Glycer's sprite looks like weird, doesn't it? Yeah, these are these are Gen 5 sprites. That Electrike's definitely far too high def for lonely old Gen 4. Oh, right, this, this guy, this guy does things. That was a crit. Okay, don't care for that too much. Not, not, not a fan of that. Fun fact, I accidentally cut off one of Swampert's fingers. <laughs> That's funny. Hey, hey. Knock it off. Knock it off. All right, that, that, that person was a little scary. Who's this next lady? Socialite Brandon? Wait, what? I thought it was a woman. Is I just not paying attention? All right, I guess her name is Brandon. That's fine. Um, snubble. 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 Headbutt. Lick. Bite. Charm. Oh, well, that was a waste of a super potion. Okay, Snubble and Spunk. We've got Snubble and Spunk. So I think... I think we're, we're a-okay here. I, I don't want to waste this guy if I don't have to. So why don't I go the chicken for Spunk? I mean for Snubble. What up, lady? I just got my Pokemon back from the daycare center. You best be careful. They'll teach you some dog shit moves. Crab hammer time? Oh, yeah, we should totally should have gone with the fish. Hey, intimidate? What the crap? 
Whatever. Well, I'll be a didgeridoo. I feel sheepish now. Go ahead, charm me. Yeah, I went for that headbutt, huh? Okay. Okay. Was not was not familiar with your game. All right, buddy. So, are there a bunch of other stuff that I need to do? Camper Todrick. Oh no, I've been sleuthed out by my odor. Bassoon, are you a stinky girl? Are you a stinky, stinky girl, Bassoon? Have you been sleuthed out via your odor? $4,000, holy shit. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. You know what's a cool Pokemon? Late Chonk. What an absolute bangerang of a Pokemon. Okay. Dre said, I'm not going to change Picnic or Gina's team at all. <laughs> uh, well, we can avoid her. I guess it's a. I guess one of them's a skip plume and the other's an Ivysaur, but that's like the evolved. Ah, oh, crap, Lyra. Why are you cramping my style with these mandatory things? Is there a is there a daycare center hatch location? Sniff, sniff. Something smells good. Maybe it's the fired chicken that I have. Uh, the popo won't fight me, right? Yeah. All right, let's go steal that item over there. Go inside and try saving. Oh, word. Yeah, I guess that makes sense. All right, let me do that. Let me go get this item, though. Did you change it? Ooh, Aerial Ace. Huge! Is what I would have said if I got this before fighting Bugsy. Rude. Don't go into the underground houses. Lyra will fight. This is Route 34. Bama, is the underground its own area? Guys, we've made it to Goldenrod. The underground is its own area? Hell yeah! So, can you get, a, can you get Pokemon there? Or can I hatch that? Can I hatch an egg? An egg. Wow, we've made it to Goldenrod. So don't go into one of the houses for Lyra. Do I have to fight Lyra or is she optional? Oh, there's a man over there too, the quiz. Optional until you have to enter the underground bits. Wouldn't they be incredibly underleveled at that point? You don't have to enter the underground until very underleveled. That's incredible. Oh my god, did you just give me bulk up in Calm Mind? It's a shame I'm not using uh, whatevers. Oh, it pays to talk to random people. So does Bill, I'm presuming you, I'm presuming that Bill doesn't give a, uh, a, uh, encounter anymore, right? I'm just a Bill.
Bill, Bill gives you cast form instead of Eevee. All right, yeah, uh, I think we're okay with skipping that one. <laughs> Anything interesting to do in here? The bike shop is worth visiting? Why? I have a bike. That's where I shove the fossil revival in the bike shop. Towel and Torkoal, huh? Torkoal, Torkoal! Um, does Torkoal get drought in this game? Probably not. What is this? Dig? Oh, shit. Roost TM? Hell yeah. And Grass cannot. Oh, it looks like... Do you maybe need to find the items first? No, I guess not. Protect, safeguard, endure, or false swipes, light screens. Is this brine? All right. Is this thunder? Thund wait, wait, wait. This isn't thunder. This is thunderbolt. Holy shit. No, that's thunder. Damn it. Damn. But can't we get can we get the TMs from the game corner? Yeah, we got so much shit to do now. Once you get to Goldenrod, this is unparalleled. Sure. Oh wow. First try. Easy. What was that? Is one of these flesh cannon? Drain punch, pretty nice. Can Combuskin learn Drain Punch? I don't think it can, which is truly messed up. All right, um, I'm probably gonna PK Hex all this shit in instead of just like changing the date and stuff. I don't think anybody objects to that, yeah? But that that'll be that'll be another time. Um I guess we can go check out well, let's go figure out what we can get from the game corner. Oh my god! <laughs> Look at him dancing! Oh I love it! I love it. This is pod racing. What is this? Oh wow, you put a person that you can buy coins from? That's incredible. Incredible. All right, let's see. What items can we get? Smeargle, Tangela, or Porygon. Interesting. Sm uh, Tangela is kind of a good encounter, huh? But do I really want that instead of... Oh, look at all these technical TMs. And these are pretty nice, too. Nice. Okay, so we'll get those. Lyra, shut up. Wow, we have so much to do. <laughs> That's funny. Yeah, sure. So right now though, we can only get Helix and like, where, where do you even get the fossils, you know? Uh, 
Oh, never mind. Looks like we can just talk to this guy, and he gives us every fossil. Lit. All right, so we can redeem a fossil. Um... Oh, Old Amber is actually not redeemed. All right, so we got we got plenty of things to think about. Things to think about. So you can just go in here and hatch some shit. Nice, that means we can go to, um... Yeah. That means we can go and get some eggs from Primo Donna or whatever. Um... Whoops. It's yes, yes, no. It's yes, yes, no. Oh, oh shit, no, it's yes, 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 no, no. Oh, what? Wow. Yes, 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 no, yes, no. Vote schnitzel. <laughs> Guys, I don't think I want to do Bastiodon again. I've done Bastiodon like so many times. We already have a couple of pretty pretty basic answers, but I'll, I'm interested to see what people fossilize. Also, can you even get Aerodactyl at this point? Like, can I find Old Amber or is it elsewhere? I thought I thought old amber could only be found in certain places. No, ruins of Alf is the place. Okay. Cool. Pikachu I don't even know how I'll deal with vanilla, gold, silver, crystal, mill tank when I do Nuzlocks again. IDK how people fight that thing in ROM hacks. Uh, you get a ground type. I mean, a, uh, a rock type. Like this guy. Or Onyx, which is pretty guaranteed. That's what I would do for gold and silver. Or I would do Ghastly because it doesn't have Scrappy then. Um, done, done, done. Okay. All right. Or we could get Spiro. We could get Kenya as our golden rod encounter. <laughs> um, oh, okay. So... I think for now, I'll just go get my encounter from the, the route below us and then call it a day.
What's the poll? Schnitzel 2, Boring Star, Arrow Boring, Kabu Boring. Wait, what about the other ones? I guarantee Kadabi. Kadabi baby. Wait a minute. What have I done? Am I? Oh, ghastly, right. So... Drowsy, Gulpin, great. Electric, Bonsly, Mime Jr., Abra, Ditto, Snubble, Kadabra. Or, I guarantee, Kadabra. Headbutt for Paneko Execute or Hoot Hoot, which can be traded for Torkoal. Eh, I don't want Torkoal. Yeah, I don't I don't want to do headbutt shit. So let's do oh, let's go for the Kadabra. If it runs away, so be it. Wait, do we have a better way? I wonder if Golbat will outspeed the issue. It'd be nice if I could put it to sleep with Bayleaf with a grass we slay, you know? get evolution stones this early, but I can get them for whatchamacallit. Um, bum, 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 bum. Wait, Dre, so do all the in-game trades, are those the ones... Is that how I get the items? I can't buy those items for, for evolving, because I'm suddenly getting a lot of Pokemon that evolve via whatever. So I'd have to, I'm gonna have to, I will make an exception for that and do the trades just to get the items, honestly. But um, where are the trades? Because like right now I could get Gengar, like just straight up. I just, are all the trades just like where they are in the original game?
Do I want Alakazam? There's one in Azalea Town's Pokemon Center. Hmm. It was like Bagon for Beldum. Maybe I just let myself evolve them. What do we think? Where, where is that thing? Is it this? Yeah. It's Gibble for Beldum? Ah! Um... If you were to catch Gibble from Union Cave, would you trade it? Well, so I got one because I traded. So the question is, do I want to make it so that I can just evolve them or like people are saying, make it a resource? It's really only for what? The four Pokemon, right, Dre? Is it just, or is it like, am I forgetting another Pokemon? Is it just the Macho Graveler Haunter Kadabra? Yeah. So. I already have Haunter. Hey, when does, when does Haunter, oh shit. Does Haunter evolve at level 25? Don't tell me it evolves at level 25. Oh! What a bummer. So I can't get Gengar before... Hi, TJ. I'll be done soon. We're just wrapping up. Um... Oh, I have another question. Did you make it so that light ball affects Raichu? I know sometimes you do that. Just peek up. Okay. Oh, we also have the Sinnoh starters to think about here. Um, okay. I don't want Kadabra then. I think we'll do it so that we have to be able to do the trade. And we have to actually do the trade to get the, the evolution item. I like that. Adds a little bit more challenge to things. So, let's, um... I'm not gonna go for Kadabra. I'm just going to go see what I get. This is kind of stupid, but whatever. <laughs> it's always Mime Jr. It's always fucking Mime Jr. It's always Mime Jr. We always get one of these guys. 
Yeah, sure. Don't tell me this has teleport, right? Oh, I should have gone to Bayleaf. Or should have brought Bayleaf. Um... Uh, okay. Yeah. It's always Mime Jr. Always. <laughs> How is that not caught? All right. Yeah. Rhyhorn, Gibble, Noctowl, Electabuzz are the available encounters. Okay. So if I get those Pokemon, then I can get the item. That's fine. Uh, what, what item is Mr. Mime? Should that be Air Guitar? I feel like Mr. Mime should be Air Guitar. Slide whistle would also be funny. All right. Um, cool. Maraca. <laughs> Still holding out for Ludicolo for Maraca, but probably not. Doesn't matter. Um, soundproof, not terrible. Mild nature, so that's what, plus special attack? Okay, okay, pretty good actually. Doesn't have a psychic type move, but pretty good. Um, okay, so let's see, so. Yeah, I'm pretty, I'm pretty happy with this so far. 34, so on 35, we can get a bunch of stuff. Bunch of potential stuff. Ooh, potentially Staravia. Or the Nidorans. Then National Park. There's a shitload of bugs. Ooh. Ooh. I don't like this. Some really good bugs, but there's some real bad bugs, too. Uh, hmm. Route 36 is guaranteed pseudo, but I don't think pseudo is all that good. Growlithe and Vulpix are both both probably better. Could get combi though. Uh. Man, these combis are nasty, dude. I can chain trade Mime Jr. for Smoochum. National Park, you can repel strats. Oh, hell yeah. For Heracross, Cricketune, Pinsir, Scyther. Love it. Or on 35, I could do Noctowl and Meowth and potentially get Torkoal or Staravia Pidgeotto. Okay, we got plenty to discuss. This will all be next stream. Uh, we'll unpack everything. We'll come up. We'll try and get all the encounters come up with a plan for Whitney. Um, but I think we have some decent answers. It's just that they're all unevolved, which is very stressful. So that's going to be tough. <laughs> Would you want Jinx? Uh, fast Ice type? Pretty good. Um, I'll, I'll look into it, but, but we'll think. Okay. Um, and it gives me another evolution. So maybe... But we'll, we'll, we'll investigate everything on Tuesday. Uh, no video this weekend because I need a little bit of a break. And um, But 
and then there will be one next week. We'll we'll have some fun. Not gonna stream on Sunday now. So um, we'll be back Tuesday with more uh, sacred soul silver or whatever this is. <laughs> um, yeah. Unless I change my mind, maybe I'll want to stream, but I don't think so. Probably not. Uh, oh wait, no, actually, I'm, we're we're busy Sunday. We're going to apple picking Sunday. <laughs> so. Hey, loyal, oh my god, loyal Leo Blade gave out 10 gifted subs. Very, very generous. Thank you so much. Um, out of curiosity, what was the, what was the fossils? Do, do, do. What, who won the fossils thing? Well, whatever. We'll figure that out later, too. Um, all right. Well, thank you so much, loyal Leo Blade. Hope you have a wonderful weekend. I hope everybody else has a wonderful weekend. Let's hop into a, Raid. Uh, Wacko's, Wacko's live. Easy raid. Easy raid to Wacko. All right. Uh, we'll unpack Goldenrod and the surrounding encounters next time. See y'all soon. Um, go ahead and spam those Flygon raid emotes as we get into Wacko's raid thingy or whatever, you know? Um, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, hope to see everybody soon. Have a good weekend. Peace.